Yeah, I think uh, to pay for all the resurrections. Plus, I think Lily would like to see at least a. F Boy, if we could get 2,500 gold on top of cost of resurrections, <laughs> whatever that might be. I think Lily's hoping for like 4,000 gold. I know that's probably asking a lot. Maybe she was spoiled with the uh, Bacillus bounty. For the group. But yeah, she'd like to see a number like that. I think we're just gonna have to deal with a. Well, or do we? A slowed down Branwin? Bronwyn? Only by two pounds. Okay. I think we got it. Nature's servant awaits. Yeah, I'm not really sure how we're doing it to carry all of Khalid's. Possessions and Imwins. And nobody's uh, over encumbered. Good thing those great oozers are gone. <laughs> that would have been uh, really demoralizing to meet them at this point. See where this took us. We're not really sure. Wow, we don't like that. <laughs> we are south of Durlag's Tower. And a little north northeast of the mines. So I think um Okay. As you direct. I think Lily is interested. Uh, again, I'm not sure if we should really wait for someone to mention Durlag's Tower, but seeing it on the map, I think uh, Lily's intrigued just uh, for the fact that it might be a mage's tower and maybe a place where she could buy uh, higher level spells than is available at Thalantir's tower in High Hedge. We're looking here because Jahira saw something, but I still don't see it. An ant keg. <laughs> Which is burrowing out of the ground, and I think I might remember these guys a bit. I don't think we want to fight them, really. I'm not sure we're going to have a choice, but I think we're going to probably try to evade if we can. <laughs> Hopefully he won't pop out in the middle of the party. Because we can't afford to even lose Zan because he's carrying equipment for um, Khalid and Emelyn. So we're going to make a break here for uh, Nashville.